welcome back to my channel. My name is May from the CXI Existence. I love to do spiritual readings and spiritual related content just like this one. So if you would really enjoy and you like to see more content like this on your TL, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like and share this video. Today, I will be talking to you guys about when you know it is time to cleanse your space okay let's get straight to it so I have my notes down here because I want to make sure you guys get every little thing okay every single bit of information that I know right now in my thought process and if anything else that comes up I will post it on my Instagram that you should go check out down below in the description box so the one way that you know that it is time to cleanse yourself is you constantly feel tired drained lethargic fatigued okay you're not feeling like yourself you're not really motivated to do anything of the goals that you set for yourself you're usually not like you okay you want to it's time to cleanse baby okay you want to be you need to get regrounded you need to recharge your energy make sure your aura is on point and recollect yourself okay whether that's like i said in my previous video saging Palo Santo, incense, Florida water, meditation, okay? Get back grounded with yourself, realign with your values and your goals. So another way that you know that it's time to cleanse you and your space is that you're easily triggered, easily triggered to being angry, stressed out, anxiety, or irritable. Um, and it's not like you. Even if it is like you, you need to reevaluate yourself and get it together because that can indicate um, that a negative entity or a negative just spirit has connected to you and is causing you to lash out on a lot of things. Someone chewing their gum too loud. Someone who's just happy. You can be triggered by someone just being happy. Okay, that's not good. That's negative and you need to cleanse yourself, cleanse your space. ASAP okay because that can be kind of dangerous especially when I get into um, the next point um, it can cause bad luck it can cause car accidents it can cause bad luck in relationships um, miscommunications bad finances losing money okay so you want to make sure that you cleanse yourself number three you find yourself being hella clumsy out of nowhere like you just dropping shit like for no reason like you pick up a crystal and that bitch just jump out your hand I know and it just jump out your hand do not want to be by you okay your energy is dense okay <laughs> you want to make sure that you're cleansing okay because that crystal do not want to be around you boo boo so that's also pretty dangerous because that can mean that it's a trickster spirit around you and um that's not good too because that's like i said before it can cause accidents it can cause financial loss and so much more you see um you accidentally hurting yourself you bump your toe or you uh let's see you trying to open something and you clock yourself in the face like you see what i mean so when you start doing that too much and it's not like you need to cleanse yourself like I said before, Palo Santo, smoke cleansing, crystal, sound, meditation, all of that. Major thing, one major, 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 major. Broken mirrors. Mm-hmm. Broken mirrors. You want to be careful because that's why I always cleanse my mirrors and seal them off because they are portals. Yes, they can be used as portals. That's just why you should never have a mirror in your room. If you have a mirror in your room right now, get that shit out your room. Especially if you're sleeping with your your um, spouse or someone in your relationship, get that shit out your room because it can cause a lot of bad negative energy for no reason. So get it out of there. Leave it in other rooms. Put it in your living room, bathroom, another room. Just don't sleep with it. Okay. And number four, you're starting to attract a lot of drama. You're really not really a dramatic, like, you're not really, like, into that kind of thing. Um, your friends, you start seeing that the people you hang with are always in drama. Birds of a feather flock together. So, <laughs> you better choose your friends wisely, sweetie. Reground yourself to get that root chakra back in line. Okay, carry you some black tourmaline. 
and reground yourself because that that's that's unnecessary energy drama who really gives a fuck you know what i mean but if you start feeding into that it's time to cleanse quickly um another time that you really need to start cleansing is if you go out a lot you go out to parties a lot or you're always in like crowded areas and small it you could be a target cleanse yourself because you don't know who you're coming across you don't know what kind of energies these people are carrying you don't know what this person you don't want that on you think of it as you're going outside and there's like a social there's like a battery on your screen right here okay and the longer you stay outside the longer it's draining you of your own energy so you have to come home and put that shit on the charger and cleanse it okay think of it like another time that you need to cleanse yourself is if you get into a heated argument with somebody or a fight it happens to the best of us you know i'm not gonna be the one to say i really we don't really have heated arguments but i mean anything that's got to do with having a disagreement cleanse yourself okay you don't need that negative energy on you um it happens to the best of us um you don't want to basically you don't want to allow other people's lower vibrations to cause you to be low vibrational which is why cleansing is very imperative um the last and final point that i'm going to say because it's video i don't want it to be too long i really want it to be straight to the point um you're not feeling like yourself you're like who am i not in like a spiritual awakening type of sense more like a i don't feel like me anymore you know what i mean people are getting you out your character you're more irritable you're stressed the fuck out you're not happy you're not achieving your goals you're just you're just not you. You want to cleanse yourself. Get, actually, get your ass in the spiritual bath. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Get yourself, get, get in the bathtub, baby, and cleanse that out, okay? Dance it out, okay? Put on your favorite music, not that little vibrational-ass music. Get you some really good music that are high in your vibrations and your frequency. Dance. Sing. Voice it out. I think that's all I have for today. I think this video is gonna be like 10 minutes if that i really just wanted to record a second video i recorded another video if you guys see my previous videos on how i explain how to cleanse so that's a video that you should watch first before you watch this one but it's kind of like too late now but it's all but uh <laughs> if you haven't you can click the thing at the top I posted it up there so you guys can go watch that video so you can know how to cleanse because maybe you're not feeling like yourself and maybe it's time, okay? So, if you guys enjoyed this video, sub hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this one. Or you want to see my face more, hit the subscribe button, hit like and share, and hit my post notification bell so you know every time I post because I post weekly. Um, I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Thank you.